here is a very typical exam question or coursework requirement or just a project you might like to do yourself and it's a design exercise where you have to have an LED that comes on when the light level falls and the specification is 200 lux and I've written out the steps over here so step one which is where we start from is we're going to add the LED now I've been given a circuit here which is a comparator circuit and it's easiest to understand if we just use this to source current to the LED so I need my series protective resistor which I would be able to work out the value for once I knew the power supply voltage I was using so there's my LED added we're now going to add the LDR to give the correct circuit operation this is possibly the difficult part we have a lot of choices so because the LED is sourcing current we need to provide current then we want the output of the op amp to come on when the light level falls so I'm going to choose to put the LDR in this position which means that when it gets dark its resistance will go up and because it's at the bottom of a potential divider the voltage at this point will go up which means the voltage at this point will go up and we should know that for a comparator circuit it's the non-inverting input which needs to go up to turn the output on so we've decided that the top input is the non-inverting and the bottom input is the inverting so we have now designed our LDR to give the correct operation. Um, the next thing we need to do is we need to design the LDR potential divider. So we need to go to the graph and the specification says 200 lux. So at 200 lux we go across and find that the LDR has a resistance of 1.5 kilo ohms. So I'll write that on, it's 1.5 kilo ohms. So the question is, what other resistor should I use in the potential divider to be most effective? And the rule of thumb is that you want to use one which is a similar value. So I'm going to choose to use this resistor here to be 1 kilo ohm, because that's fairly similar to the 1.5 kilo ohms of the LDR. I could have chosen 1.5k, but I'm going to choose a 1k resistor. So that's that part done. So now all I need to do is design the reference voltage potential divider. So the reference voltage is the voltage at the inverting input. So I need to choose a value for this resistor and a value for this resistor. And this is the crucial part. These voltages here and here at the two inputs, the inverting and non-inverting inputs, V plus and V minus must be equal to each other at the point where the LED comes on. So I've got to make my potential divider, my second potential divider, this one here with the, the green question marks, give the same voltage at 200 lux as my LDR and 1K resistor are doing, which means that my two resistors have to be in the same ratio. So I'll label them for convenience sake. And what that means is for R1 to R2 must be in the same ratio as 1k to 1.5k. They've got to be in the ratio 1 to 1.5. So I could choose 1 ohm and 1.5 ohms, but that wouldn't work out too well, take too much current from the battery. So what I'm going to actually choose is 100 kilo ohms and 150 kilo ohms, and they are now in the right ratio. So if I label this as 100 kilo ohms, and I label this as 150 kilo ohms and now I have completed my design exercise and the two parts which are difficult are the putting the LDR in the correct place and then realizing that the other potential divider has to give you the same voltage at the point where you want it to switch so it has to be the same ratio and that's how you do those sort of questions.